find the Taylor series for f of x is equal to sin x about x is equal to zero. So f of x is equal to sin x, f of zero is equal to sin zero equal to zero. F dash of x is equal to derivative of sin x equal to cos x. F dash of zero is equal to cos zero, which is equal to one. Then second derivative of f of x, that is equal to derivative of cos x equal to minus sin x. At x is equal to zero is equal to minus sin zero equal to zero, sin zero equal to zero. Again, derivative of minus sin x is equal to minus cos x. Third derivative at x equal to zero is equal to minus cos zero equal to minus one. Again, derivative of minus cos x equal to minus into minus sin x equal to sin x. At x equal to zero is equal to zero. So sin x cos x minus sin x cos x, sin x cos x minus sin x minus cos x. Now at x equal to zero, zero, one, zero, minus one, zero, one, zero, minus one, etc. So the Taylor series expansion for f of x is equal to sin x at x not equal to zero or the Maclaurin series of f of x is equal to sin x equal to summation n equal to zero to infinity nth derivative of f at x equal to zero into x raised to n by n factor. So this is the general equation for Maclaurin series. Now, which is equal to first term f of zero, f of zero equal to zero first term zero, second term, first derivative of f at x equal to zero, equal to one, one by one factorial into x raised to one, one by one factorial into x raised to one, equal to x. Second term, uh, th uh, next term is equal to zero, second derivative of f at x equal to zero is zero, then next term, minus one, minus one into x cube by three factorial next term 0 then next term x raised to 5 by 5 factorial into derivative of 5 f uh, fifth derivative of f at x equal to 0 equal to 1 so 1 into x raised to 5 by 5 factorial next term minus x raised to 7 by 7 factorial next term plus x raised to 9 divided by 9 factorial etc so this is the maclaurin series for f of x is equal to sin x or equal to summation n equal to zero to infinity alternate minus pros minus plus minus plus so minus one raised to n x raised to one x cube x raised to five x raised to seven that means odd powers of x x raised to two n plus one n starting from zero to infinity and divided by one factorial three factorial five factorial odd factorial odd numbers factorial is of odd, odd numbers that means uh, x raised to n by x raised to 2n plus 1 by 2n plus 1 factorial. So sin x is equal to summation n equal to 0 to infinity minus 1 raised to n x raised to 2n plus 1 divided by 2n plus 1 factorial. This is the Maclaurin series of f of x is equal to sin x or Taylor series about x is equal to 0. Next problem. Find the Taylor series for f of x is equal to 1 by x square about x is equal to minus 1. So f of x is equal to 1 by x square. f of minus 1 is equal to 1 by minus 1 whole square equal to 1. Then derivative of 1 by x square minus 2 by x cube at x is equal to minus 1 equal to minus 2 by minus 1 whole cube equal to minus minus plus 2 by 1 equal to 2. Then second derivative of f x equal to 2 into 3 divided by x raised to 4. Minus 2 into minus 3, that is equal to 2 into 3, 3 factorial divided by x raised to 4. At x equal to minus 1 is equal to 3 into 2, that is 3 factorial. Third derivative, minus 2 into 3 into 4 by x raised to 5. At x is equal to 1, minus 1 is equal to minus minus uh, into minus 4 factorial by minus 1 raised to 5. So minus minus get cancelled equal to 4 factorial. 1, 2, 3 factorial, 4 factorial. Next one, 5 factorial. Fourth derivative at x is equal to minus 1 is equal to 5 factorial. Similarly, uh, goes on like that. Uh, nth derivative of f of 
matrix at x is equal to minus one is equal to n plus one factorial. So the Fourier series, uh, the Taylor series of f of x, one by x square is equal to nth derivative of nth derivative of f of x at x is equal to minus one into x minus x not the whole raised to n by n factorial x minus x not x not equal to minus one so that is x plus one whole raised to n by n factorial nth derivative of f at x is equal to minus one is equal to n plus one factorial so n plus one factorial by n factorial into x plus one whole raised to n that is n factorial n factorial get cancelled remaining n plus one into x plus one whole raised to n so this is the Maclaurin series or Taylor series of f of x, uh, not Maclaurin series. It's it's it is the Taylor series of one by x square about x is equal to minus one. Next one, oh, find the power series representation for e raised to minus x square. So we know that the uh, expansion of e raised to x or e raised to y is equal to. One plus y plus y square by two factorial plus y cube by three factorial plus y raised to four by four factorial plus etc. Y raised to n nth derivative of y divided by n factorial. So just replace the y with minus x square. We'll get the expansion for e raised to minus x square. That is equal to one plus Minus x square plus minus x square whole square by two factorial plus minus x square the whole cube by three factorial plus minus x square the whole square four by four factorial plus etc. Which is equal to one minus x square plus x raised to four by four fact uh, two factorial plus x raised to six by three factorial. So minus x square the whole cube which is equal to minus x raised to six by three factorial. So alternate minus plus plus minus plus minus plus minus etc. That is the nth term is minus one raised to n x raised to two x raised to four x raised to six etc. Even powers of x that is x raised to two n divided by uh, x raised to four divided by two factorial x raised to six by three factorial etc. x raised to two n by n factorial. So this is the Power series expansion or Taylor series expansion of f of x equal to e raised to minus x square or uh, Taylor series about x equal to zero or Maclaurin series of f of x is equal to e raised to minus x square. 